Hey y'all and welcome back to the party. It's your girl Britt Reacts and today we are reacting to It's Happening, Gabriel Iglesias. Let's see what he has to say. See, up to this point, we have agreed on how we raise our son. But in this situation, she's trying to protect him from the world. I'm trying to prepare him for the world. If he cannot handle me raising my voice to get his attention, to see the bigger picture, he's not ready for a world that doesn't care about his feelings. That's fair. Very fair. So I say, you know what? I got to have a one-on-one -on -one with him. I got to have a one-on-one -on -one without <laughs> <laughs> so I take him out to the movies. I take him out to the movies. We get in the car. We take off. I'm pretty sure uh, Gabriel co-parents, because he's mentioned like his girlfriend and his son, unless they just have been like lifelong partners and like a, a long-term relationship and they've never been married, which is also a thing. Um, but if this is a co-parenting situation, I feel like this is a, a common like I don't want to call it an issue. I just think it's a common thing for maybe even any parents. I, I co-parent. I don't, uh, I co-parent. And then I have my husband. But uh, sometimes you just have different perspectives on like things with raising your child. And especially like one parent is typically firmer than the other. I'm the firm parent in my situation. I am the firm one. And so I'm always the one that's kind of like, no, this is what she needs. <laughs> So I agree with him here. So I take him out to the movies. I take him out to the movies. We get in the car, we take off. <laughs> little 20 minute drive, okay? As we're driving, I figure I'll have a little one-on-one -on -one with him. Maybe this way it doesn't feel like a talk talk. I thought he understood what I was trying to say. It's late, we're leaving the movies. We're pulling out of the parking structure and out of the corner of my eye, I see a cop car and I made a sound. I was like, ugh. And Frankie goes, what is it, dad? said, there's a cop at the light. What are you worried about? He's going to stop us. How do you know? Watch. <laughs> I made that left turn. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie's losing it. It's happening. <laughs> I said, relax. I pull over. <laughs> cop pulls up from behind. <laughs> Immediately. Driver, windows down. The sound effects never get old. They never get old. They're so good to me. Oh my gosh. Driver, hands out the window. Serious? <laughs> Both of them. I can't, I'm fat! <laughs> He gets to the window and he's got the flashlight and he shines the light right in my face. He's like, license. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here. He takes the license and then of course, you know, do you know why I stopped you? Officer, no, I don't, but I'm sure you're about to tell me. You don't have a front plate on your car. I said, officer, you're absolutely right. I do not have a front plate on my car, but my name is actually on the front of the car. Excuse me, my name is on the front of the car. I own a 2012 Ford Flex, and the Ford Flex has the actual work. That is so interesting to me that he owns a 2012 Ford Flex. This man could probably own any car he wanted to, but he's a humble man. Um, I, Mike, what? Your name is on the front of the car. What does that have to do with the license plate? That's not the same thing, right? Right? word flex written on the hood. I have a friend who does custom automotive work and he took all the letters off the car except for the letter F and he made letters so that it spells fluffy on the hood. Okay? Yeah. It sounds impressive. You can do it too for like $23. It's not that bad. They're like refrigerator magnets. You can even move them. <laughs> like one day a letter flew off and it said foofy. Look at me, get pendejo. I know, stupid, right? So the officer walks around to the front of the car and he takes his flashlight and he shines the light right on the hood. And he does this, he goes, I knew it. And my son goes, what does that mean? I said, that means we get to go. 
Oh, Houston, for the first time in a long time, my son was actually impressed by something that I did. You got to figure, this is, is not impressive to my son because he grew up in this environment. Okay, this does, you saw that, right? Yeah, what was that? I saw like a, <laughs> what was that? That's like the third one I've seen. It's like stuff keeps, <laughs> people upstairs from Tomball. Oh, keep talking. This is like the third or fourth bit I've seen him talk about like police recognizing him and him getting let go. <laughs> I'm just like, I mean, by all means, if a cop is going to let me go for any reason, I'm going to. But it's just like, that's not fair. <laughs> that's not fair. All right, I'll tell you guys what happened. Shakira performed here a few days ago, and, and Shakira has an amazing show, okay? She doesn't just come out and la 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 He's getting into it. He's getting into it. Is that like leftovers from her show? Myself. <laughs> but there's a part of her show where all of a sudden it goes, and there's cannons with confetti that shoot everywhere, right? That's what it is. And I think that was leftover Shakira. <laughs> yeah. Can we edit out the part where I, I burned 800 calories? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my God. So where was I? Oh, this does nothing for my son. And the reason why I say that is because he grew up in this environment. He's been to a thousand shows. He's seen me on TV a million times. It's not a big deal. But the fact that I got stopped by a cop and the cop recognized me and geeked out and let us go, I earned street cred with my kid. <laughs> yeah, Frankie was like, that's the coolest thing I've ever seen. And I'm like, hell yeah, cuz, that's right. <laughs> you better recognize, player. <laughs> We get home, he woke up his mom. Mom, you should have seen it. We got stopped by the cops. Okay, so I guess he doesn't co-parent. Then I was wrong. I just have seen him often, oftentimes refer to his partner as his girlfriend. So, I mean, I, you know, families look very different. I shouldn't have assumed. Uh, but either way, I do think when parenting happens, there is a softy and there is a non-softy. And I play the non-softy role in my situation. <laughs> Let me know in the comments which parent you are. Are you okay? Yeah, they recognized that and they let us go. And she stayed quiet. And I told her, huh? I got recognized. And she said, ah. That's it? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, I mean, according to Gabriel, this happens to him quite often. Lucky guy. Um, that I can see why a kid would be impressed by that, you know? This is his dad's job. The other thing is like, no one likes to get stopped by the cops. So if we can get off, that's, that's lit. <laughs> anyway, all right, y'all. Go have the day you deserve. Peace.